Thank you for watching my video. This is a review of Glary GIB J Style 5 Strings Early Wood Bass Guitar. This is a review and demo. Thank you for watching my video. Somebody said it was a glary around here. That must be it right there. That's got to be it. Let's see. Man, this looked like a glary. Oh my goodness. This must be the GIB J style five string. Burley wood. Yeah, that must be what this is. I don't know. You see those knobs though? You see those knobs right there? That knob and that knob. I'm sorry, that knob and that knob. Looks like some stuff has been changed. Could that be the Tone Monster preamp? The SBK 3AD? I don't know. Let's check it out and see. Oh, right there is a Rumble 40. A Fender Rumble 40. Well, let's plug it in and see what's, what's going on. Man. Ain't nobody told me nothing. They just said it was a glary in that in there. In that little studio room. Well, let's see. Okay. Look like the rumble 40 is on. Right, everything is at 3 o'clock. Right at, I'm sorry, 9 o'clock, right there on like 3. If you were looking at numbers 1, 2, 3 going around, that's, everything is on 3. Let's see what this glary sounds like. You know, they say this is a very inexpensive uh, guitar, which it really is. <clears throat> it's 129 and that's including shipping. It takes about three days. It's 34 inch scale. Five string, 24 frets, it weighs 6.4 pounds, and it's passive, when it first comes in, it sounds real good, I mean it has two volume knobs and two tone knobs for each pickup, it comes with two jazz style pickups, and it sounds real good. But I just wanted to do, this is like a project base. I wanted to do a project base. Um, I wanted to do something different. So when I ordered the Glary, 
I asked, I ordered the uh, Tone Monster preamp also. Um, the guys at Guitar Fuel, Ty and the guys, were nice enough to send me a Tone Monster preamp. Comes in a box like this. Nice little white box. No knobs, just a preamp already hooked up and everything. All you got to do is hook up your pickups uh, to one of the pots. And that's it. Um, I had to wait a few days for my knobs because I needed some stacked knobs. I needed concentric knobs for the bass and treble and for the mid. The mid is a mid sweep. If I'm not mistaken, I think it goes from 250 to like 2K. Something like that. It's crazy, man. But boy, let me tell you, you can get so many sounds out of this guitar. And, you know, there's one negative side about the guitar. One main negative side about the guitar. And that's, um, the neck is a little chunky. But, you know, it's a project guitar. I had already known that I might just do some sanding on it. And uh, one thing that's for uh, that the the neck did come in pretty much unfinished, so it's almost like Larry knows that um, you're gonna do some work on the neck, or like they give you a certain size neck and say, okay, you make it the way you want it to be. But anyway, it's not that bad. Uh, one another thing I can say, <clears throat> excuse me, when it comes in, like everybody says, leave it in the box for a day. Leave it in the box for about a day and then take it out of the box and let it sit out for another day or so before you start trying to adjust the height and, and, and you know, set up the neck and all that stuff. Oh, yeah, it does come with a carry case. It comes with two Allen wrenches, one to adjust the neck, the truss rod in the neck and one to adjust the, the uh, intonation back here and the height back here on the bridge. Um, oh yeah, like Johnny Long, Johnny Lee Long says, this, <laughs> this is a bridge. <laughs> That's Johnny Lee Long, one of my one of my guys that I watch almost every day. I think I've seen almost every one of his videos. He is the person that introduced me to the Tone Monster preamp, and um, I'm just glad to have it, man. I, you know, the bass didn't cost much. The preamp was fifty nine bucks. So, I mean, you're looking at out the door with shipping right at about 200 bucks, man. You can't beat it. And you can't beat it for what you're getting ready to hear. All right, let's, let's listen to it. I don't have much time left. I think I've talked a little bit much now. But let's listen to it. Everything's off. Got everything off. Um, let's go to the rear pickup. Rear pickup and volume. turn up just a little bit. Alright, let's go to the front pickup. Get that fatness? And you hear my strings, I, I, my, my strings are really low, like Johnny, like, like Johnny says, they are under the neck. <laughs> They're under the neck. They're real low. Real low. All right. That's real quick. Let's dial in some stuff. Let's dial in uh, some mid. Let's go D10 on mid. dial in a little bit of bass, a little bit of booty.
let's dial in some highs. everything up real quick don't have much time and then you know what honestly that's still a back pickup let's go to both pickups everything's at detent both pickups here we go everything up everything's wide open mids wide open bass is wide open and treble is wide open here we go All it does, it just takes what you got and it enhances it. It don't add a whole lot of uh, uh, different effects and all that stuff to it. A whole lot of contour, it don't add all that stuff. It just takes what you have and add to it. Let's go to the front pickup real quick. Everything, um, front pickup, everything's at D10. Larry, GIB, J Style, Five String, Burley Wood. With the Tone Monster preamp from the Guitar Fuel guys. Guitarfuel.com. Tone Monster preamp, SBK 3AD. Check them out. Thank you for watching my video. Please do me a favor and just like it. I don't need a whole bunch of subscribers. I'm not gonna be doing a whole lot of videos. I just wanted to do a video of the, the, uh, the Glary and the Tone Monster together. You can buy something inexpensive, buy something else, and make a beast out of it. I mean a real beast. Have a blessed day. We'll see you soon.